Hi, it's Andy Gorman here. I've got Gravity Fit, a piece of equipment that is designed to help you stay totally connected during your golf swing. So it's connecting your arms. Never get the feeling that you're sort of separating with your arms and you swing a little bit careful or slap yourself in the head with this. Um, and, and your kind of swing's just not quite there, especially for me. Putting a short game, this is awesome. Um, keeping everything connected. I see a lot of disconnection in short game um, and, and gravity fit's definitely going to help me to get the feeling into my clients. As you can see, there's a spiky ball here. It's largely used for training purposes as much as anything uh, to do with golf. Um, I'm not going to take it out, I'm just going to leave it in there. And you've got these little contact points here which will then go on your shoulder blades. Um, it, look, allegedly, this is really difficult to get into, but for me, very simple over the top of the head, there we go, up through the arms and you can see how it fits across the back. As I then pull through here, I can then slide these back in towards my chest and then I've got a simple connection with the thumbs over the top there but I go in, hands in first and then we've got a little twist over the top there. And what that allows me to do is to now get a feel for moving through the chest, not with my arms, and no chest movement. So what I've got, simple movement back and forward, nice chest rotation, with a wedge, works really, really well. As I'm setting up now, I can get everything in place, make my grip, I've got these therabands are nice and thin. So yes, I do feel it here between the thumb and the finger, this is the corner of um, the thumb and, and the palm of the hand, really. But it's not invasive, it's not uh, excessive force, and it's definitely not going to cut the circulation off. Um, as you can see now, it's connected across my shoulders, and then as I make the swing from here, I've got movement going back, so I've got good chest and hip rotation, really important to my teaching principles, and on the way through, we get enough resistance on the band to help the arms Make contact with the ground, you can still do that with the force and speed of the swing, but it's not going to let me get hyperextended with my arms through the shot. So really important that we get a nice solid connection through, nice hip rotation, nice chest rotation, but the hands and arms do not get away from the body. So they keep it nice and tight. You go through here, you can see more down the line, the arms don't get away, they're held in nice and tight to the side of my body. It's a really important aspect of short game. Our struggles in short game invariably are caused by the arms getting away from the body. Right? So when we're swinging back and through, you can see now the chest rotation, the golf clubs exiting out the left side of my body as I turn. But I turn through with no excessive extension. Really, really strong training aid. Comes with the green bands as well, largely used for the fitness training side of things. As fit as it can be, I don't need to be worried about this, but it's a, I can see how this works really well. Again, connections through the back helps with your chest, keeping your chest out in a good, strong position. And you know, again, if anything we can do to improve our posture, it's going to help. How it works with putting, grab the putter. And then from here, very simply, you know, same, same way really, it's, it, just as we were with the uh, chipping exercise, the drill here, the putter will feel a little bit light, okay, that's the only thing I'll say about it, and with good reason, you know, that's, there's no issue with that, but for me, just makes me feel a little bit light, forces a slightly lesser pressure on the grip, so I'll become a little bit more sort of focused on that, but from here, moving the chest, I feel like the big muscles are in control, the chest back and through, and I felt that that was taking it outside the line, it just dragged me away a little bit, didn't have the control that I wanted, so, you know, get into a nice posture, get comfortable, and now let the arms, leave the arms to do what they do, but let the chest take control, I just felt that the hands were a bit in control, and that's all I would say, you know, not necessarily negative, 
but it's a different feel and if you start to get away with your hands and with the short putts I think this is where it will really work strongly for the short putts you've got to feel that your chest is more in control of the putts when you get, it's all too easy for us to get in there and start swinging the putter with our hands because we only need to move it a very short distance a very slow speed so when we can get into a good posture and just work comfortably off the chest that's going to help us stay connected again it's a drill or product that helps control that connection so you know when we are a little bit handy it tells us so that's not a bad thing we can putt with our hands at relative short distance but then we offer some errors okay uh, potentially to the contact that we need to know and if we have that tendency in the stroke then ultimately we can you know come up short or not so much come up short but we're going to miss these putts i mean coming up short is one of those miss factors of course the key here really is that you get to feel for it before you actually execute and sort of hit the ball you get that feel for what you're trying to do you want the the chest to have full control over the initial part of the putting stroke of course there's nothing else it's a, it is an initial movement that we're going to putt with when you get into a fuller swing you want to feel that the chest is controlling the movement of the arms move back through the right shoulder that pulls in effect the left shoulder uh, around and pulls the left arm and the, the right arm back as well so when you stand over a putt the fact that it actually feels light would suggest that you may be using your hands a little bit too much and for me if we can get that focus on working through the chest you know getting full control over the club because of the chest movement then that's going to give us a much more successful rate of holding putts so maybe initially it felt like a, a negative but actually part of the strength of this is that it actually tells you if you are getting a little bit handsy and you know there aren't many training aids that will do that for you as you take it away allow your arms to hang you know feel like you're getting your circulation back it's of course not circulation that's an issue you're just getting the feel of your arms back and the putter cool the putter feels really heavy because now it's not suspended by anything and again it all comes back to what is the feel from here it's all about my chest if i've got chest control then that putter is going to deliver a nice consistent blow to the back of the ball gravity fit give it a go you'll enjoy it